Welcome back to the channel. I just thought I'd make this video for the ride out I made uh, a few days ago when we had that bit of sunshine um, before the end of March, as I promised myself that I should do. But uh, things didn't go according to plan. Um, the, uh, the audio and video issues are still haunting me. So that lessons learned video that I did earlier, I'll put a, a card at the top there, a link. Um, really, I didn't, wasn't, didn't learn much from that. So I'll do a post-mortem, a behind the scenes section at the end of this video, just explaining all the things that went wrong and maybe the one thing that went right. So uh, enjoy it. It's a trip around my backyard on the North Wessex Downs and uh, uh, North West Hampshire, Berkshire type area. The don't think I wandered into Wiltshire. Um, so uh, enjoy, check out the uh, bit at the end. No plan. I'm just gonna mosey in my backyard.
So, hope you enjoyed that. Um, I certainly enjoyed it. It was a lovely sunny day and we've had miserable weather ever since. And uh, I did get it in before the end of March. So what went wrong? Well, basically, we'll start from the top. When I hooked up the uh, Insta360, I had it on three minute loop. So that means it only ever recorded the last three minutes. I was out there for an hour, hour and a bit. So all I got was those last three minutes. Yes. Then, the audio. I did plug in the uh, mic into the uh, GoPro and I did cut it up and I stuck it inside the helmet. And But for some reason, I don't think it was actually recording from the mic. I think it was still using the external mic on the GoPro. So I didn't switch it, you know, to make sure it was using the, the external mic plugged in. I thought it auto-detected it straight away, went through. So anyway, so I was busily talking to myself, going around for that hour and a bit. And then I thought, well, okay, maybe the audio from uh, the uh, iPhone that I had with the chest mount, because um, I had a, an actual mic into it, pinned into my jacket, stuck it out from underneath the jacket. I thought if it's shielded from the wind down there, it might have picked up some stuff. Uh, no. That was that was pretty awful as well. So I thought, well, maybe the uh, the iPhone 8 Plus that I stuck on the uh, quad lock on the handlebars might have picked something up. But no, I'll show you some of the clips uh, on that. But uh, that's awful. That's an awful idea. So probably the the 8 Plus might might have to be my my Kalimoto uh, machine, and, uh, and that's its job. Full stop. Uh, so yeah, so I. I'll have to do another ride out. Hopefully the weather's gonna get better. And uh, this time not only check everything, but double check everything. And I think I will use the app on the phone just to triple check everything just before I set off. Just to make sure the GoPro's correctly, the Insta360 Insta is actually on and recording correctly. And I'm hoping the app's on there, which I haven't really looked into in great detail, but I would when I have to, is that they are actually gonna tell me exactly what's going on. On, on, on the cameras, that the, the GoPro is using the external mic and it's the right settings, uh, recording at the right uh, uh, 4K, 30 frames, uh, wide or super wide, and that the Insta360 is actually recording uh, properly and not in any of the bullet modes or um, the, uh, the loop mode, etc. And maybe that's the way to do it. But anyway, when I was setting up, I was thinking I was cock a hoop, thinking everything was great. Off I go, hour and a half, talking to myself, talking to myself, out in the middle of nowhere. Okay. We learn, we learn. So hopefully the next one should be better. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please uh, subscribe if you feel like it. Uh, and tinkle that bell so you get an alert when I next post. And uh, I will catch you on the next one. So, take care. Bye bye for now.